guys, today I will be doing a doll transformation, kind of. I'll be trying to um, do a transformation for my doll, so now I'll show you my doll. Okay, she looks like this now, and she's pretty old now. I have the same, she's Jenna. If you watch my um, videos, you probably know her, the neighbor, but I want to change her. She has a ugly blue hair here, and then her hair is really, like, gluey, and I don't really like and this is how she looks now. I think I'll take everything off. Like, I'll take her shoes off. And I think it'll be great. So, I'll, now I'll go sh go and wash her hair. And then we'll try to do something. <sighs> okay, so I just washed her hair here. It looks like this. I know it looks really tangly. But I'll try to brush it with the hairbrush. Alright, I'll brush it like this. Because it's really comfortable for me like this. So, let's try to brush it. It's really tangly, but the, the hair color will, I guess, never come out because I used a permanent marker to color it. But maybe I'll color the whole hair. I'll see. So it looks great now, I guess. It's nearly finished. I'm nearly finished like this. It looks good here. And I think I'll do the back to make more sense. Okay. Okay. I'll come back you, to you guys when I'm finished brushing it. Okay, now it's all brushed. Now I'll get the scissors and I'll cut her hair. Okay, so I got the scissors right here and now I'll try to cut her hair. I'm not sure how many I want cut her. I guess like this much, like up to, you see this hair piece, like up to there. So everything will be nice and even. Alright, so let's do it. I'll just like, okay, like up to here I guess. That's pretty nice. Alright, so I can hear the, I can see the um hair coming out of it and it looks pretty good okay so when i'll be finished i'll come back okay so i'm well finished but i now i want to just add some like bottoms there okay this is how many hair i have here looks pretty good i guess it's maybe just a bit more i guess like this like this like this okay it's getting pretty even yeah 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 all right i'm nearly finished i guess and i saw like people do this i don't know why they do it but i'll do that too i guess and i want to hair make her hair into a nice uh hairstyle so i'll see what i'll do okay now let's brush it and see if it's even <laughs> I want to cut her hair um, kind of um, more because it's not even as you can see here. So I'll cut it a little more. I'll just cut like over here. Okay. And over here. Okay. That looks pretty good. Alright. Now let's brush it and see if it's nice okay i don't want to cut too much and i want to leave her hair like this on this link so i'll not cut it more even if it's not really even like as you can see here it's like super duper short and then here it's like super duper long as you can see so if i do this you can see like her hair is not really even so i guess i'll cut it a little more i know yeah i'm just like I won't get it, so. Okay, now I want to make the hair even every single piece, I guess. So not do too much, but not too less. So I finished her hair. I think it looks... Okay, I think if I finished her hair. It looks pretty good. And I decided to color her hair. So let's see how I'll do it. Don't really... And I just remembered I have to dry her hair before I'll color it, so I'll do that now. Okay, so I found a cool way how to do, how to um, dry um, a doll's hair. So you just get a straw, and then just get, like, do this, and put it in your mouth like this, and then just blow it like this. Alrighty. 
Okay, I guess I think it's all pretty done. I think it's not really um bad. I think it's not really wet now, so I think I can pick the color. Okay, I think I picked the perfect color. It's pink. One of my favorite colors. So let me paint it now. Okay, so let me do it. I'll get the more um, thicker side, and then I'll do it. So I'll start. I don't want to paint her whole hair. Well, I'm not sure about that. I'm so scared to do that, so yeah, I'll think about it. Okay, so I'll try to do it now. Okay, so I think, hmm, I don't know. I'll think about it more. Okay, so I made a super cool trick that I want to do that I'll use this pink marker to cover her lips so it'll look more realistic that she'll actually have her lips closed. So I'll try that. I didn't figure out the I think I'll just go strike by strike and I'll see how it'll turn out. So I'll just do this strike and just color it in. Okay, so let me color her hair. Shh. All right, guys, so I found a super duper cool thing to do. I want to change Jenna into Anna from Frozen. So I guess I'll start all over again. I'll use this or this shade of orange. It's already open because I opened it. I'm not sure if it's working. I said it's working. So I'll use this shade of orange and then I'll use this shade of orange, kind of darker. Whoops. Kind of darker and I'll just use them. And I wanted to add this shiny red just to make him more shiny and cool. So yeah, I'll do it right now. So guys, it's going so well so, um, so far and I'm using the brown too because I re just realized Anna has brown hair and orange hair. So. Okay guys, I love how it turned out. It looks perfect. It looks lighter on camera, but it looks perfect. So I love it. Now I found some clear hair bobbins here and then I'll just make her into two plots. Okay, now it's time to make the clothes. And the shoes. So I got the clothes and I think it looks pretty good. So this is how she looks. So she has this nice hair. I know she has this clip over here, but I'm doing her hair so it'll not stay like out. So I'm sorry for that. And then I made her hair like that. It's pretty good. And then I have her dress. She is blue with some tulips on it. And I didn't do this way because I think it looks pretty good like this. So it looks on the back. And I think it doesn't look that bad. So yeah. And I didn't get her shoes yet, but I think she looks great. So yeah. You'll see Anna in the other videos. Thanks for watching. Bye. Subscribe to my channel.